Good morning and welcome once again to the glorious Peak District. I'm out for a wander today at a weekend, which is quite unlike my walking patterns. I'm out with my uh, girlfriend today, wave and say hello. <laughs> so we've just walked up Padley Gorge and we're heading for Higator, Car Walk and then looping back around down Millstone Edge and then back down to the bottom of Padley Gorge. Thank you for the gate uh, opening there. Looks like some folk down there in the river. It's quite a humid day today, as you can probably tell by the, uh, the look of me. Yesterday absolutely threw it down. I'm not talking throw it down, I'm not even talking torrential rain, I'm talking ridiculous rain. Um, thunder, lightning. So I thought today maybe a little bit less humid, but it turns out it's still quite warm. Right, so we're just heading up in towards the, the Longshore Estate now, and it's looking good. I'd like to say that's what the glorious Peak District does to people, but I think she's actually listening to uh, <laughs> show music. <laughs> oh well, that's what the glorious Peak District does to me anyway, but I just never record it. <laughs> We'll get there in the end. There we are. Right, so we've just left Carl Walk. We've climbed up from the Longshore Estate and now we're heading towards Higator. Right, welcome back. So we just had lunch upon Higger Tor, just up there, and we've climbed down. We're working our way over towards Millstone Edge now. Some climbers up on the gritstone there, and we're just finding our way through the fern. Tick Haven. <laughs> I'm always paranoid about those things, especially this time of year. Never actually seen one in the Peak District myself, um, but I've seen them in the Lake District. I had one crawling on my arm in the Lake District. Yeah, I hate those things. Welcome back. So we headed down from Higator down towards Millstone Edge and we came across Surprise View and we're now heading back down into the forest down towards Padley Gorge once again, Bowl Hill. I think it's Bowl Hill Quarry. Um, it's quite a nice forest this actually. Lots of discarded millstones further up that way. Um, we didn't go down to them, we carried on this path along here. Got some friends. Welcome back. We're back in uh, Padley Gorge again now, or just on the western side of Padley Gorge. The river's down at the bottom there. So it's been quite a good route actually. I think it's going to be about six miles in the end. Um, but what I'll do is, as always, links in the description. 
you can head on over to an excellent website that I mentioned quite a lot and that is shareyouradventure.com um, if you head on over there you can find a map of today's route which ordinarily I'd be tracking live but um, I've had the, the live element of it turned off today I've been using View Ranger on my iPhone it's also available for Android and you can post your locations live providing you have signal uh, to shareyouradventure.com so head on, over to the, head on over there and you can find the map from today. Right. Right, welcome back. So we've walked up from the bottom of Padley Gorge now, or from the entrance and the path there. That's Grindleford Station in the distance. Uh, we just stopped for a quick ice cream. It's, it is the law especially in summer you've got to stop for an ice cream and that's the walk over but we're going to head to Chatsworth now I think and throw ourselves in the river possibly what do you think jump in the river do it, do it. we're doing it I think it's recording Change of plan. We're going to head for Lonsdale. Right, welcome to Lonsdale. We're just on the edge of Matlock here, probably about half a mile out, and what a place this is. It's absolutely stunning, as you can see. I'll come back here for a longer walk, but uh, it's really worth a visit. There used to be lots of mills dotted along the length of the river here, and thankfully, this area is now being preserved and maintained by the Arkwright Society, the famous Richard Arkwright, who built the mill down the way there in uh, Cromford, 1771. So yeah, what a stunning place. I'll give you a few more like shots and peaks at this place, but it's certainly worth a look. Oh dear. Come on. High five. 